Hello everyone Techrons here and today in this video we will learn how to install Android 13 in our PC. It supports in all Windows version, 7, 8.1, 10 and 11. First of all open your browser and search for Android Studio. Open the first link which appears on the page. I will also mention the link in the description. Click on the green download button then scroll down accept the terms and conditions and then click on download. Wait till the software gets downloaded and make sure you have good internet speed and plan. After the software has been downloaded simply click on it and run the software. Wait for couple seconds to load the setup. Close your browser and hit next. Click next. Follow my steps properly don't skip or miss any option or else you can end up with the error while installing. Make sure your system has minimum 3 GB space free before proceeding further. Hit next. Click install. Just wait it will take a minute to install and hit next. <laughs> Click next. Click on finish and wait for few seconds till the software starts. Just hit OK. Just wait for some time till the software gets ready. Click on don't send and hit next. Install type first one is standard and the second one is custom I will show you both the methods you can select any one which you want. UI theme dark and light select the one you like and hit next. License agreement, as you can see the red star symbol on the left side under licenses section. It's showing red because you haven't accepted the terms and conditions. Select custom and hit next, again hit next. Don't change anything, just hit next. Now here you can select the RAM as per you require but I will suggest you to let it be as default. Click next. Click next. If you won't select the Intel Android extra license option and hit accept you can't move ahead and click the finish button. You will have 
to select both Android SDK license and Intel Android Extra license and then check the accept option. Only after that you can proceed further by hitting the finish button. Click on finish button. Now here it will download all the required files for the installation of Android 13 on your PC. Downloading will take some time as per your internet speed, so wait till the download gets completed. Click finish. Welcome to Android Studio. Now this is the main software where we will create our virtual device. Click on more actions. Move down to the last option virtual device manager and select on it. On the left top corner you can see create device click on it. Select hardware on the left side you can select the category according to your need from phone, tablet, TV. Now choose the model and make sure you select the model which contains Play Store logo in it. So later you will be able to use Play Store installed in your virtual device same as your phone. On the right side you can see the dimensions of the model you choose. Select your model and hit next. System image. Here you have to download and select the Android version which you want to install in your virtual device. We gonna install Android 13 so we will select Tiramisu. Android Tiramisu is the internal codename of Android 13. Now it's downloading the Android 13 version file of approx 1.4 GB. After the download gets completed select the version and hit next. Click finish. Android virtual device, AVD, you can change the AVD name to whatever you want. 
Select the orientation as per your choice portrait or landscape, then scroll down make sure you have checked the box of device frame. Click on show advanced settings here you can change the camera settings in my case I don't have any camera so I am selecting none for both. Do not mess up with any other settings which you don't know or don't understand. Click on hide advanced settings and click on finish. These are the two devices which are installed in my PC. The first one is which we installed it right now. Click on play button to load our device. It will take some time as it's loading the device for the first time. You have successfully installed the Android 13 in your PC. Click on the power button as the first boot will take 5 to 10 minutes. So hold back and relax till the phone boots up. First boot up may also be faster depends as per your system hardware and processor. In my case it took a bit more time because I have a low end performance PC. Like the video if you enjoyed it and don't forget to subscribe the channel for more upcoming contents. Thank mm -hmm. you.